A War Averted, Bismarck's Speech Against War In 1850, Otto von Bismarck was a young deputy in the Prussian parliament. He was a passionate supporter of Prussian might and power, and he dreamed of German unification. However, he also saw the horrors of war, and he knew that a war against Austria would be costly and bloody. When the parliament rallied to the cause of war, Bismarck gave a speech that astonished all who heard it. He spoke of the madness of war, and he praised Austria and defended her actions. This went against everything he had stood for, and it confused and angered many of his colleagues. However, Bismarck's speech had the desired effect. It helped to turn public opinion against the war, and it ultimately led to the king and his ministers averting war. A few weeks after his speech, Bismarck was rewarded for his stand against war. He was appointed to the cabinet, and he eventually became the Prussian premier. In this role, he led Prussia to victory in a war against Austria, and he helped to unify Germany under Prussian leadership. Bismarck was a complex and contradictory figure. He was a man of war, but he was also a man of peace. He was a patriot, but he was also a pragmatist. He was a brilliant strategist, but he was also a master of deception. Bismarck's story is a reminder that there is no single path to greatness. Sometimes the best way to achieve your goals is to go against your own beliefs. Sometimes the best way to win a war is to avoid it altogether. And sometimes the best way to unite a nation is to break with tradition.